So this is the code for the first question and we have here a class, okay, my class, and then we create an object of that class providing the value 12 and we print the ID, the property ID of that object in the end, okay. This class, this my class, have a function, the init function, the constructor, that receives a parameter that is the id, it assigns to the self.id the value of id, and finally it changes the value of id to be id plus 10. So, what would be the output of this, okay? And the first option is 22, the second option is 12, and the third option is an exception is thrown. Let's run this, let's open the terminal and execute, and the result is 12. Let's understand this. First, Python loads the class my class. Then it goes to this line of code where we create an object of my class. Because of that, it will navigate to the init function of my class, creating the variable id. Then it creates the self.id variable that is pointing to the same object. And this is very, very important to understand the next instruction. Because in Python, integer objects are are immutable. So, when we do id equals to id plus 10, a new integer object is created and the variable id is now pointing to that new object. In the other hand, self.id still points to the old integer object. So, this is why we get the value 12 when we do print mc.id.